What's up guys welcome back to my channel so i just got back from watching super pets dc league of super pets it was a cute movie to me me and tyrone went to go see it we didn't see it in 4dx or anything like that we just went to go see it it was a really cute movie it was a really really cute movie don't want to spoil it too much um i don't know if any of you are planning on seeing it or if you did see it but it was pretty cute um, how the story went about. So, you know, you've got all the superheroes. You've got Superman. You've got Batman. You've got Green Lantern. You've got Wonder Woman, Cyborg. Then you've got um, Lex Luthor. Um, so then you have these pets. <laughs> so first of all, Superman has this dog, his super dog that fights crime with him wherever he goes. One minute he's a regular dog, next minute he's got a cape. Super duper cute, right? So then there is this pet store where there are some pets there, you know, who look to get adopted. And um, things kind of take a turn when something happens with Lex Luca, what he's trying to do, when he gets stopped and a little piece of what has been stopped comes back to one of the pets. One of the pets is trying to, she, she's big on world domination. So she is like this little itty bitty thing and she is just trying to take over the world. Meanwhile, these pets are trying to find a way out. Um, and you know, along the way you've got Lois Lane who you know Superman is with in the card you know in, in this movie um, and then at some point you know all hell breaks loose this little animal goes and she you know gets this thing I don't want to say what it is but it, it it turns into a big disaster right it turns into a humongous disaster but um there were some points where I was just kind of like, I wouldn't say it was a glaze over. It wasn't, I, I, I don't know, it just didn't catch me. But for the most part, it was a really, really cute movie. Um, Let's see, because I don't want to spoil it too much if you guys still want to go see it. So, of course, you guys know that The Rock, uh, Kevin Hart, Keanu Reeves, um, they're all voicing some of these pets. Um, and it it's like you would think that <laughs> you would think that Lex Luthor would be the one behind all the craziness that's happening and it's not it's not it's totally not so then of course the pets get together with the super dog because something happens with Superman and now they all kind of come gotta come together to go get Superman from wherever he is and of course the rest of the Justice League comes out and stuff starts going crazy. At one point, so the way that the movie starts, it was so super cute. So, so super cute. And then it kind of switches up to, you know, present time. And I was just like, all right, what's going to happen now? There was this one part in the movie that was probably the funniest part in the movie like me and Tyrone were cracking up so there's this little pig she's one of the super pets and she is such a Wonder Woman fan and at one point she says something I don't remember it it was like something along the lines of oh and she says oh it's something something for us and the way that she makes her I don't know, it, it was between what she said and the way she had her teeth in her mouth. It, I don't know what it was. Me and Tyrone were just cracking up. Then at one point you see like this little kitty. Sounds like the cutest little thing. But like, literally, like a small little kitten. And this thing was vicious, full of missiles and bombs and... It was crazy. It was absolutely crazy. But, you know, over time, 
you know, they kind of came together. People got saved. You know, the super pets became super powerful. They all, you know, came together to to um, save the world. But um, it was it was really super cute. And there is a post credit scene. There is a post credit scene. Um, so there may be another one coming. But it had its funny moments, it had its cute moments, it had its sad moments. Um, overall, I give this movie three and a half toodles. Three and a half toodles. They did a really, really good job. And at the end, I don't want to give it away, but it's cute. The way that it ends is really cute. So three and a half toodles for a League of Super Pets. Leave your comments down below. Let me know if you enjoyed my review. If you guys want to go see it, let me know what you guys think. I didn't want to give away too much in case you guys want to go see it anyway or if you took your kids to go see it. It's definitely um, kid-friendly. They have some pretty cute things in there. Um, I think overall it's a nice, you know, family-friendly uh, uh, movie. So... Let me know down below what you guys think. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit like, share, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you guys can be notified whenever I pop up on your feed. I'll see you guys later.